Hello everyone and welcome to the Engage Services tab. Here we're going to provide a little bit more information about our program, but first let's go ahead and review information about Engage students and staff. At the beginning of each semester, we start with something called a person-centered plan meeting or PCP. A person-centered plan serves to empower students to plan, follow through, and advocate, advocate for what they want out of their college experience and thereafter. Students, engaged staff members, and the student's VRC, or Vocational Rehabilitation Counselor, will meet to plan goals and approaches to meeting their goals academically, vocationally, vocationally socially, and personally. After the person-centered plan is in place, engaged staff will meet with students on a weekly basis to track progress towards their goals. Meetings often, often include visiting places on campus, organizing class assignments, checking and responding to emails, and anything else the student needs. As the student participates in Engage, our staff will make referrals as appropriate to community and UNT partners who provide support in achieving the student's goals. I'm now going to go ahead and talk about the diagram visual. In the diagram, the colors correlate to the areas of students, areas of support we provide for students in terms of the levels of support they are needing. The closer a student is to the center, the more areas of support they might need. The, the closer they are to the outside, the less support they might need. And as they get closer to the outside in that blue region, that's where it could be a little bit more um, specific or they might only need support in one or two different areas. So for example, they might only need academic or only need professional or only need social support. I now want to go ahead and talk a little bit more about how we provide supports to our students based on their individual needs. The level of engaged support is based on the individual level of need for each student. At the beginning of a student student's time in the program, they are required to have at minimum two check-ins per week with, with one, one with their coordinator and one with their graduate assistant. As the student progresses through, their prog pr through the engaged program from semester to semester, they are expected to increase their professionalism and show mastery of skills learned in previous semesters, which means their level of support from engaged may decrease over time. Students may go from two direct one-on-ones per week to one direct one-on-one -on -one with their coordinator and meet with their graduate assistant bi-weekly, leaving them space to attend campus events and engage staff as present at. So let's talk a little bit more about weekly meetings. All students, regardless of support level, will meet weekly with their engaged coordinator at the student's scheduled time to discuss their goals, progress towards their goals, and anything else the student needs to discuss. Students may also have a second weekly check-in with their engaged graduate assistant for additional support as needed. These meetings can include, but are not limited to, student mentoring and case management, open forum for students to discuss personal and academic concerns, self-advocacy -advoc support and training, collaborative problem solving, vocational supports and training, and referrals to UNT and community resources. Lastly, we want you to know that engaged staff will make referrals as appropriate to community and UNT partners who may provide support for students' goals. Some co common partners include, but are not limited to, the Office of Disability Access, the UNT Well Clinic, Counseling and Testing Services, Student Health and Wellness Center, UNT Speech and Hearing Center, UNT Career Center, the UNT Learning Center, Eagle Chat, or other NeuroNet services. To learn more about these individual services, please click on the name, the name of the and the link attached, and it will direct you to direct you to their site. Thank you. Have a great day.